It's a GameCube game, bro. They're like hard to find in the wild. Would you do 20? <laughs> what do you reckon, bro? Oh, man. Would there be a price on every single one? All that, yeah. Oh. What have you got there? Some Jordan. Yeah, that was pretty sweet. These are cool too. And then the Pokemon cards. Yeah, mate, so they're 60 on them. 60? Yeah, and then these ones are Oh, I'm feeling good about today, guys. We are back Sunday morning. We're heading to the local flea market, Carrara Markets, here on the Gold Coast. This is one of my favorite hunting grounds. We can find some really cheap items to sell for a profit on eBay. That's what I do full time, and uh, I do love rolling out here every Sunday morning. Uh, let's get into it. We'll see what we can find today. How much on the shoes? 30 bucks. 30 on those? Yep. What are you thinking? 15? Go on then. Yeah? Yeah. Sweet. Take a for five bucks. Apparently there's something in the car. Oh, oh wow, man. What you got, brother? That's epic. Oh, wow. <laughs> what are you looking, bro? <laughs> oh, man. Well, I had a look on Did eBay. You got a game? That's... Went for 600 the other day. Yeah, it's it's some really good stuff, mate. How much for the entire tub without me knowing anything? Well, that, that's for you to give me a price. Is that right? I'd have to go through it all and really kind of work it all out, hey? Do you know the value of it? Roughly. Yeah? Yep. How much? Um, Just to save time. 1200 1200 and what would you uh a thousand two hundred like if it was twelve hundred my offer would be like three hundred you know what i mean yeah yeah because yeah. i'll take fees i'll take postage yeah. um i'll sell a lot individually and i always try and times four to yeah. get half yeah so i'd net about 300 mm. on that yeah so i'd be looking at like you make 300 i make 300. Yeah. like that one there's a fake game yeah um just because it says game boy like that oh, well, that's okay. that's a. Uh, that's not genuine. The fans want to see these, mate. Yes, we're getting those for five dollars. We're getting that's that's a purchase for sure. Does these look look genuine? They're both Australian. How much would you say for these two? Oh, you shoot a price, and I'll. I'm not knowing too much about condition and them working and checking further in into authenticity. I'd go twenty bucks for both. Yeah. I'd go 50. Mm, yeah, I'd probably pass on 50. Mm. Just still be reluctant to just whack them up as they are onto, yeah. onto eBay without doing a bit more research. How much are we looking at on these games? Three. Two bucks? How much? Five. Rats. Have you ever worked with Jax? Jax is here somewhere. I see. Yeah. So we're going to go with these. Yeah. We've got seven games there. So seven times two is how much? Fourteen. Fourteen dollars. Well, let's do, let's do fifteen dollars hey then. Hey guys, like my Gucci glasses? Looking good. Comment down below. <laughs> All right. Do fifteen on those, eh? Yep. So a pretty, pretty sweet Game Boy. Uh, collection there but i ended up passing just wasn't sure on the authenticity of them um, but we managed to nab those uh, ps2 games uh, mainly ps2 games and i think they will go between sort of 15 to 20 bucks uh, but we got them for two dollars each so you can't really be going wrong when you're buying games for two bucks and uh the disc looks good so i think they'll sell pretty quick but um plenty of stalls here let's get back into it look these are the shoes that i want what about this donkey kong hat I don't like Donkey Kong. You don't like Donkey Kong? Super Mario 2014. I like that. I think someone would like that. I think someone would like that. What about that. this? Penrith Panthers NRL. I'm messing up all some two times you, some Nike. Oh, remember these? That's a Yowie. What's this one here? Oh, some Powers. Oh man, I've got to do this. That's a cool hat. So we're going to go Donkey Kong. We're going to go Austin Powers. You know what else I like here? Jordan. I like, I like this. Daddy, 
the Ronald McDonald. How cool is that? 2005 McDonald's. I reckon that will do well. What have you got there? Some Jordans. Yeah, they look pretty sweet. These are cool too. These are really cool. Comment down below if you think these are cool, guys. We should find out some price points, shouldn't we? Uh, I've got a few things so far, just some hats and some toys. Um, but I'm interested in a few of your shoes. How much on? 30 on that one. You got 30 on that? Yeah, yeah. How much on the Austin Powers? I'll do 20. 20 on that. And then these two? 30. Yep. 10. Okay. And then your shoes, how much are we talking? Are they all individually priced or? They're all kind of about 20. Okay, so basically any shoe that I grab, we're looking They're at 20. about 20, yeah. Yeah. If I bought a few, could we? No. Oh, depends what ones you buy. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Um, well, let's start hey, looking Matt, a few Have you out. ever seen Converse? I'm going to go give away my Jordan. <laughs> see you, mate. Good to see you. All right. We've got these three here. Would you do 50 for those? Yeah. Yep. Let's do that. So she had a really good booth. There were so many items that I could have grabbed, but I think the price points were just a little bit too much, unfortunately. Um, the hats and the toys, you know, it's just talking 30 bucks, 20 bucks a piece. That's exactly what I'm going to try and sell it for. So that was really frustrating because it was sort of old vintage sort of items as well, which was really cool. Um, the shoes, they were also a deliberation for me because 20 bucks, you guys know if you're watching this channel, it's the most that I'd spend for a pair of shoes. So to buy bulk at $20, I thought that was going to be a little bit steep, but managed to get the three that I thought were going to sell the quickest on eBay. We're talking around $50 each for those. Um, so the Gazelles, the Kyries, obviously with the issues that he's got with the NBA at the moment, I think the Kyrie shoe and also Nike as well aren't working with Kyrie at the moment. So anything Kyrie Irving I'm trying to grab. So those shoes were cool. Uh, and then there was that third pair of gel Nimbus. I grabbed them because they were a US size 15. And I'm just thinking that they might move a little bit quicker because they're a bigger size. Anyway, enough rambling. Three pairs of shoes, 50 bucks. Not a bad stall. Would have liked to have bought more. But there's plenty more stalls here, so let's keep moving. Back on my page, oh, so. did ya? So what do you, what do you sell? Um, I like a lot of vintage poker balls, like trading cards and comics. And... So pretty much everything here is your sort of jam on eBay, yeah. hey? That's epic. And we'll give the... Uh, Give this a bit of a shout out. You yeah. Get a few people following you. Uh, only like 30. I only opened it up a week ago. Only a week ago. Well, let's get this man uh, a few more follows on his eBay store. Oh, what was your name? Andre. Andre. Yeah. I'm Matt. Really nice to meet you, man. Good. That's a great collection. How you going, mate? Good, man. Would there be a price on every single one? All that? Yeah. Oh, jeez. Would, oh, yeah. would that produce any type of margin? Oh, yeah, well, it would. We'll, what have we got there first, though? Let's have a look. This is about 400 there. 400? For those prices. Yep. And 250. 250 is the best. Yeah. Um, where are your price points at on these shoes? Mate, I'm at. I'm trying to what I bought from. I paid 64. Paid 60 for them? Yeah. Bronze are so sweet. And um, I can't sell shoes, man. On eBay? Yeah, they don't sell for me. Oh, I've got to say, mine have slowed up. I, I don't know what it is, so like, I have, I've got to advertise at 90 on there. I've had a heap of messages, heap of watches and everything. Yep. But yeah, no one's bit the bullet on them. So yeah, wow. Well. if I could just cover what I paid. Yep. Get I'd your be, 50. I'd be happy. Yeah. And these are good too. Clear outs. Yeah, right. And then the Pokemon cards. Yeah, mate, so the 60 on them. 60? Yep. And then these ones here, I'm just pricing them off eBay. Price off eBay, yep. Sweet. Start the set. Would you do 20? <laughs> I'll do 20, my man. 
you know what? I'm such a big kid, I will keep that. That's fair. I had all of them, I had all of them going up. Really? Yeah. So sick, dude. I didn't realise it's 40th anniversary already. Crazy, eh? Crazy. <laughs> I'm old, man. <laughs> How much are we doing on the Kobe's? How much one? Oh, the Kobe's, yes. Just six way. What does that give you in a women's? So Eight? two up. No, it's seven and a half. Seven and a half women's. Yeah. yeah. One and a half up, sorry, not for you. Obviously not for you, are they? No, no not for me, mate. <laughs> My YouTube is about selling on eBay. Oh, is it? Yeah. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Oh, they're gone. You got a PS2 though. Yeah, I don't have a cord for it though. It's okay. How much on it? About 20. 20 bucks. I'm just filming a YouTube video. That's cool with you. You don't have to be in it. <laughs> don't put me in. You're not in it. Your voice might be though. Uh, 20 bucks, eh? Look for your do 15. 15? That's generous. It's super generous. Oh uh, well, I appreciate the PS2. No worries. That's a great hookup. I'll go and get these Kobe's now. <laughs> for 40, right? For 40. We'll see about that. So what are we doing? I'm looking up to see how much I pay for them is what we're doing. Ah, uh, good man. Good starting point. Yeah, I can not be for you now. I knew it was in the hundred something, but yeah. I thought it was maybe hundred. Yeah. 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 Nah, no stress. All good. Back on the mantelpiece. Yeah, man. Yeah. It's my only pair. It's a hundred dollar mantelpiece. <laughs> that's, that's the way I look at it. Yeah. Nah, all good, man. Appreciate it, though. All the best. You got another deal right here. So it ended up just being shoes and video games out of today's haul, guys. I definitely noticed that the uh, the price points have significantly gone up since I've last been to the flea, which was definitely a few weeks ago now. I don't go as much as I used to. Um, but a lot of those items, just really good items that I just had to pass on, not enough margin in them. I get it though, they've got to make their cut as well. So uh, it just is what it is. Fingers crossed we can get back there in the next few weeks and find some better bargains. But hopefully you've enjoyed the video, having a bit of poke around my local flea market. Um, here was a really good flea market video a few months back actually that I did really well at. So hopefully you can enjoy that one. I uh, appreciate you being here guys. We'll see you soon.